first of all, I'm very proud of Michael and I miss him dearly. And I'm just here, you know, to, to take on his legacy and let people know that we're here for the public. So anybody that want to come over and see the house or, or, you know, just come by and just see the house and be a part of the, of, of you know, the Jackson home here on 2300 Jackson Street in Gary, Indiana. And uh, that's pretty much it. My family, we just, you know, we miss him dearly and we just want people to, uh, if they want to come out and show their respects and everything, that's great. You know, just come out and we're here uh, to talk with you and, and, and just let you know that we really appreciate everything you guys have done and standing by Michael through all his, um, all, all through his life. June 25th, we're going to have a memorial, candlelight memorial for Michael. And then also for his birthday, August the 29th, we celebrate Michael as well. So this is annual and we, you know, hope people come out from all over the world to come in and support and be a part of this event. Once again, it's in the family. Uh, when I was a kid, I, you know, I was right there before there was anybody. And, and my Uncle Joseph and my dad played. They had a group called the Falcons back in the day, my Uncle, uh, my Uncle Verl. And from that point, just growing up, I've always been the music. And the first time I seen Michael perform over in Chicago, Skokie, man, back in the 70s, uh, I was like maybe, ooh, seven, eight years old, you know. And, uh, and when I seen him on stage performing, just let, let me know that's what's something I really want to do in my life is be a musician. And, you know, when you can make people happy and make people sing and dance, I think the world would be, you know, be strange without music. So I really believe that it's a God-given talent, and, and that's what I do, and it's just a part of the family. Ever since I was young, I've been growing up on Michael Jackson, Jackson 5. My mom was huge in the Motown when I was younger. Raised me on Jackson 5 and Smokey Robinson, and then eventually I just started like just getting into Michael Jackson. Everything, every time he was on TV, I'd be taping with the recorder. Every, t oh, every ja the Jackson 5 reunion they had, I taped that. The making of every video he had, I had every CD, Dangerous, Bad, Invincible. I bought all his CDs. It was just, oh, it was amazing. His music is just inspirational in itself. If you just listen to what he says in his song, all his songs are about healing the world, you know, just making the world a better place. That's really what he was trying to do. And I think that if you just just listen to his music, you'll really you'll find comfort in his music.